Hello, welcome to the live reaction slash commentary on the Nintendo Direct for September 13th, 2018. It begins in less than a minute. I hope you're strapped in for whatever Nintendo thinks we want. Because we don't want 20 NES games. We want... GameCube games and Nintendo 64 games and Mario Sunshine Remastered. I mean, come on. Or Mario 64 Remastered. Or Animal Crossing. Or a new Golden Sun, like your new trademark suggests. Or who knows what? I don't know. Not. Don't. Don't. Metroid Prime Federation force us today Nintendo that's all I want that's the extent of my desire all right it's five where is it okay here we go What? Okay. I thought that was the remaster for 3DS, but I guess not. Hello everyone, I'm Shinya Takahashi, and I'll be your guide for today's Nintendo Direct. As you just saw, we kicked things off with a new reveal, and I'm pleased to confirm that Luigi's next spooky adventure is in development for Nintendo Switch. Good. We have a lot to say about the game, but we'll have to save that for another time. Good. Now, let's cover some upcoming games for Nintendo 3DS. Please take a look. The pink puffball gets crafty again. The 2010 Wii game Kirby's Epic Yarn is warping to Nintendo 3DS. Okay. In Patchland, practically everything from enemies to obstacles to who knows what else, is entirely made of yarn. Even robots, somehow. And to beat courses made of yarn, you gotta use moves made of yarn. Every stage from the Wii version is making a return. And the Nintendo 3DS version is also being puffed up with some new features. When you pick up items, you can craft bigger yarn balls, or you can even conjure up some wind to rake in the beans. For a little added challenge, see if you can outrun this speed demon of a devil in devilish mode. To top it off, new minigames will give you a chance to play as some other familiar faces. Kirby's Extra Epic Yarn launches exclusively for Nintendo 3DS in 2019. Come on, Nintendo. Bowser Jr., destined for greatness? The Mushroom Kingdom has a bad case of the Blorbs, and the only ones who can save it are Mario, Luigi, and Bowser? It can only be Mario and Luigi Bowser's inside story. There's another side to every story, even this one. Now you can go on Bowser Jr.'s journey as well. In his new adventure, Bowser Jr. sets off to find his own remedy for the Blorbs, but thanks to his signature selfishness, he ends up causing more problems than he cures. Better gather some allies and build up your very own army. Create your own formations, support allies with an arsenal of moves, and conquer the chaos in every action-packed battle. Is Bowser Jr. destined for glorious kingship like his papa? Mario & Luigi Bowser's Inside Story plus Bowser Jr.'s Journey releases on Nintendo 3DS January 11th. That name is too long. Hunt Ghost with Luigi and a second player? While you're waiting for the new game on Nintendo Switch, don't forget that the original Luigi's Mansion is coming to Nintendo 3DS. That comedically spooky vibe that fans remember is intact, even when you're playing the new two-player mode making its debut in the Nintendo 3DS version. 
If you and another player each own the game, one of you can play as this even greener guy. guy Come on, YouTube. As you explore the mansion together. Or, if only one of you has the game, you can still play boss battles together in the gallery using download play on your Nintendo 3DS systems. Oh yeah, in Professor Egad's lab, you can tap select amiibo figures to surprising results, like revealing hidden booze, or healing Luigi when he talks to Toad. Each of the four compatible amiibo has a different effect. Luigi's Mansion will haunt Nintendo 3DS on October 12th, just in time for Halloween. Yo-Kai Watch Blasters is out now, with even more free content coming later. Whether your allegiance is with the Red Cat Corps or the White Dog Squad, Yo-Kai Watch Blasters will let you team up with friends to tackle the most action-packed battles in the series yet. Soon after launch, you'll have another way to squad up. You won't want to miss the free software update on September 27th, which adds the Moon Rabbit Crew version to the title screen. This additional content boasts new bonuses for linking save data between Red Cat Corps and White Dog Squad, as well as new missions, new areas to explore, new yokai to befriend, and new Big Boss yokai. Why, you ask? You know why. And if you don't, Now's the perfect time to become a fan. Yokai Watch Blasters is out now. And don't forget about the Moon Rabbit Crew update. Come on, YouTube. How's it going? Garbage. Well, from here, let's focus on Nintendo Switch titles. Oh, good. Please take a look. You only spent five minutes on 3DS. It's Inkopolis news time. Okay. Am I supposed to be able to read this? Bad producer. Tell people to go to Tumblr. Everyone's favorite blue robot makes his triumphant return in Mega Man 11. Mm -hmm. Marking the 30th anniversary of the iconic series, this brand new game is gunning for greatness on Nintendo Switch. Jump, slide, and shoot through each of the colorful, challenging stages and try to take down a gallery of deadly bosses like the formidable Bounce Man. In timeless fashion, you must defeat the eight robot masters and get each of their special weapons. The technological miracle of the new double gear system makes for a fresh take on the series' satisfying platforming action. Move so fast that time slows down around you. Temporarily enhance your weapons and show them who the real boss is when you need to most. Mega Man 11 also supports the Mega Man amiibo figures. You can tap one each day to receive E-Tanks and this other, other amiibo I've never items. seen in my life. Mega Man 11 will be ready to rock October 2nd. Did I miss that announcement or something? Mario Tennis Aces, further refined in new update. 
Some popular Did you finish the game? The, roster. the adorable all-round ace, Birdo. The sharp shooting specialist, Shy Guy. Where's Birdo and Smash? The proud high flyer, Koopa Paratroopa. Let's make him a Yoshi boss, no Echo racket, Fighter. Petey Piranha. Birdo. Boss, no racket, Petey Piranha. These Mushroom Kingdom greats can be acquired by playing online. And we'll keep adding more until next June. Until next June? There will even be a new mode called Co-op Challenge. It'll let you participate in online co-op missions that are only available for a limited time. Complete the objectives while these missions are active, and you'll receive special outfits, characters with alternate color schemes, and more. We'll continue serving up new content for the game in the future. Yeah, all right. The version two update for Mario Tennis Aces will be our Come back on, in man. action. What just happened? Back in the day, Capcom lit up the arcades with some classic beat 'em up action games. And guess then what? Then it crapped itself the and skipped. Back. Final fight. The King of Dragons. Captain Commando. Knights of the Round. And Warriors of Fate are making a comeback. And so are these first time home console releases. Armored Warriors and Battle Circuit are joining the fight for a total of seven games. If you each have a Joy Con controller, up to four players can beat them up together. Aspiring Bash Buddies can even take the fight online this time. Oh my god. Pretty soon. You'll be able to play with other Capcom fans from around the world. Because Capcom Beat 'em Up Bundle will be ready for action on Nintendo eShop September 18th. New Super Mario Bros. U is getting the deluxe treatment. Which oh, means good. it's time to take down Bowser and his Koopaling invasion in the Does Trident Shrew Side Scroller headed to Nintendo Switch. Mario, Luigi, and Toad are all here. And if that's not enough, Nabbit and Toadette are joining in the fun as well. Great. Nabbit doesn't take damage from enemies, which can really come in handy. And if Toadette powers up with a super crown, ta-da! She transforms into Peachette. Peachette can double jump, float what? slowly during free fall, and get a boost back up if she falls into a pit. Luigi's first starring role in a platforming adventure, New Super Luigi U, is getting the deluxe treatment too, and okay. comes free of charge. Fantastic. A single Joy-Con controller is all a player needs, and up to four players can join in together, anytime, anywhere. A good announcement. Finally. New Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe comes down the pipe January That's 11th. That's too late. Should have been November. Nintendo Switch is ready to roll. Are you? Katamari? It can only be Katamari Damacy, remastered in HD. That naughty king of all cosmos has made a mess, as he hmm. does. And now you better take control of the prince here and roll. Just roll and roll all over the place and all over stuff until the gradually growing mass towers over buildings. The clump, or Katamari you roll, will shine on as a beautiful star in the sky. On Nintendo Switch, you can enjoy the game's new gyro controls. I can't, I HD can't Rumble, enjoy that. And even multiplayer battles by each using a Joy-Con controller. At 10 frames a second. Roll it till you reach the stars, anytime, anywhere. Katamari Damacy Reroll will launch Winter 2018. Next, we have some more news for you. We've announced some details about Nintendo's new service called Nintendo Switch Online, including the launch date. You won't have to wait long. The service will begin September 18th. We prepared a video to show you what's offered with your Nintendo Switch Online membership. So please take a look. I mean, this whole thing is a video. More games, more features, more fun. Nintendo Switch Online. Allow us to introduce five features included with your membership. Of course, you can play compatible games together online, even when you're far apart. 
compete against players the world over, or team up for some great co-op action. There are so many ways to have fun. A variety of games are supported. So find your favorites and take them online. You can even play classic NES games anytime, anywhere on Nintendo Switch. Get lost in the gameplay, whether you're the boss or the little monster. Are you For multiplayer the games? games, each player can grab a Joy-Con controller. So both of you can share in the fun. NES games can also be played online. As they say, playing together long distance makes the heart grow fonder. Oh, I don't see that. Look forward to a growing library of NES games. Luigi knows that no matter how careful you try to be, something unexpected can happen. Accidents can cause your precious save data to disappear. But help is on the way. With Nintendo Switch Online, game save data is automatically backed up in the cloud. Even if your console breaks, your save data will be safe from harm. Nope, nobody wants it. Nintendo Delete Switch it. Online nope. also connects with the smartphone app. Nope. With this app, you can voice chat with friends while playing certain games. It's also called a phone call. Backseat players can also join in the conversation. That way, everyone's having fun. Yeah, okay. The service even has the ability to enhance certain games by connecting with them, like Splatnet 2. Members will also receive special offers. What are they? We'll have more to announce in the future. Uh, more games. That wasn't more helpful. Features, more we fun. knew all of that already. Nintendo Switch Online. The service begins September 18th. Think about which plan is right for you. If your family has two or more accounts, you can save some money with the family membership. How's it look? Well, we have one more thing we'd like to introduce. This Nintendo Entertainment System style controller works with NES games on Nintendo Switch. This one here is the left NES controller. And this is the right NES controller. We created them so you can play NES games like the ones you saw in the video, just like old school gamers did back in the day. Oh, Please yeah. enjoy them with Nintendo Entertainment System, Nintendo Switch Online. Back in the day. These controllers wirelessly connect with Nintendo Switch. And you can charge them by simply attaching them to the console. Mm -hmm. We hope you'll enjoy using these controllers to play this growing library of classic NES games. For more details about Nintendo Switch Online, please check the official Nintendo website. Now, let's get back to some more Nintendo Switch games. Good. Your partner Pokemon is amazing! Get ready to set off on a Kanto region adventure with your very own partner Pokemon in Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. Yeah. Today, we want to share a couple things that you and your partner can enjoy in the upcoming game. During your adventure, you'll occasionally come across obstacles blocking your path. When you do, you can rely on a secret technique to get past them. Secret techniques are special skills that only your partner Pikachu or Eevee can use in the wild. Use them to chop down trees that stand in your way travel across water or soar into the sky. Furthermore, only your partner Pikachu or Eevee can learn certain powerful moves for use in battle. Plus, if you pet your partner while your Nintendo Switch is in handheld mode, you can change your partner's hairstyle depending on how you use the touchscreen to pet it. Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Pokemon Let's Go Eevee will launch on November 16th alongside the Pokeball Plus accessory. Also, Look for two new bundles that will include a Nintendo Switch system with Pikachu and Eevee-style Joy-Con controllers, one of these two Pokemon adventures, 
and the Pokeball Plus accessories. We're doing so good, you two. The gates to the burning hells will open on Nintendo Switch. <sighs> Nintendo said hell. Of course, we're talking about Diablo 3, the dark fantasy adventure that may just consume your life both inside and outside the game world. From the high heavens to the burning hells, you'll explore the full story and the deadly world of Sanctuary for loot-filled bounties and rifts to randomize dungeons with even greater spoils. I've already played this enough. Hunter, barbarian, Crusader, Necromancer, Witch Doctor, Monk, or Wizard, with up to three friends online, offline via local co-op, or on a single console couch co-op style. You can even suit up in this Nintendo Switch exclusive transmog armor fit for the King of Evil, Ganondorf. All Amiibo figures are compatible, allowing you to summon a group of challenging enemies overflowing with sparkling goodies. Diablo 3 Eternal Collection invades Nintendo Switch on November 2nd. Oh my god. We've souped up the Mario Party series with new types of gameplay on Nintendo Switch. I'll never use YouTube again Shake for Shake the Joy-Con controller and get your body grooving in soundstage. No. Or dive into the series' first four-player co-op mode, River Survival. No. Bet you've never played anything like Toad's Rec Room, which cleverly connects two systems. Of course, the four-player board game mode that fans love is back and full of new features. By rolling character-specific dice blocks with alternate numberings, you can make a game-changing comeback. You got stuck. Every last minigame is brand new, all 80 of them. For a party of one, check out the new single-player modes. You could play through a series of minigames to complete specific tasks on Challenge Road. Compete against players around the world in the online Mario-thon minigame mode and more. I can't believe Nintendo assumes I have friends. The festivities begin when Super Mario Party launches October 5th. Great. Not surprised me. A new story in a village with a secret to hide. Nope. Game Freak presents a brand new RPG. The story is set in a small village. Under the protection of a great castle, the settlement enjoyed lasting <laughs> peace. That is, until the sudden appearance of monsters. Oh, Indeed, I thought they were going to have like the a The entire name. story takes place in this one single village. Wow. Take up arms against invading That's monsters. That's not a good way to sell this game at all. And strategically select from a variety of this battle commands. This game takes place in one town. When the situation calls for it, enlist the aid of fellow villagers to surmount powerful threats. What secret does the village harbor? Find out when town releases in 2019. That is a working title indeed. I agree. Develop a city anytime, anywhere. Get the wrecked, critically acclaimed city. city building game City Skylines is coming to Nintendo Switch. Get wrecked, Spider-Man. There's a city in need of a new mayor. Come to that city. You. And you've got some real moving and shaking to do if you want to improve quality of life, energize businesses, and stimulate growth. Whether you're investing in roads and power lines, public facilities, or transportation services. How the city develops is totally up to you. You're kind of a big deal. But in this game, sometimes it's the small details that stand out most. You can watch over every single citizen's movements. That's creepy. What's more, both previously released downloadable content packs After Dark and Snowfall are included in the Nintendo Switch version. Mm -hmm. Flex your mayoral might at home or on the go when City Skylines launches today on Nintendo eShop. Shadow Drop. A tale of belief, blood, and steel. The moon has fallen. Now, the world and its inhabitants are on the brink of extinction really cool in Daemon X Machina. As a mercenary, you'll pilot a powered suit called an Arsenal, face down runaway AI. As you defeat enemies during combat, you'll acquire their weapons and parts, which you can equip on the fly. If you haul acquired weapons back to the base, they're added to your personal armory for use in future missions. Each arsenal can be equipped with multiple weapons. And now it's the Gundam By crossover. between projectile and melee attacks, you can adapt your weaponry to the situation at hand and gain the advantage for your side of the war. Uh -huh. At any time during battle, you can exit your arsenal to explore the field on foot. You can make enhancements to strengthen your human form, and your arsenal's abilities will be augmented as well. 
Up to four players can join forces in online co-op to take down massive bosses. Oh, it's like 10 frames a second. What are you doing showing that? Damon X Machina launches in 2019. A big adventure in a miniature world of crafts. Okay, Yoshi, finally. In a world made of it stuff like boxes world, and right. paper cups, Yoshi will leap up high, gobble enemies, and hustle on by. Many unusual obstacles litter the landscape. A well-placed egg could open a new pathway. You could turn the stage on its head, or flip the perspective. Explore every nook and cranny to track down hidden collectibles and make it to the gold. Along the way, wait, what? You can play the course backwards? Guess a change in outlook really can show you a whole different side of the world, the flip side. Know any would-be Yoshis? Then pass a Joy-Con controller to a friend. There's plenty to love on all sides of this crafty world. I love Yoshi. Right, Yoshi? But I feel like so many Yoshi games have been sequels. Yoshi's Crafted World releases in spring 2019. To Yoshi's story instead of Yoshi's Island. Tabletop gaming is a perfect fit for Nintendo Switch. And to prove it, Asmity Digital, a leader in card and board games, is bringing full adaptations of best-selling tabletop games to the system. Build a medieval world in a full adaptation of the award-winning Carcassonne, complete with 3D maps, solo mode, four-player local multiplayer, and the game's famous expansions available as paid DLC. Whether you play alone or alongside a second player, forge a powerful deck and a fellowship of three to face the forces of Sauron in each story-driven quest of The Lord of the Rings, The Living Card Game. Stop the spread of four diseases and cure them all on your own or in local four-player multiplayer with Pandemic. Plus, it's individually priced DLC based on popular expansions. Thanks to Asmodee, this is just the beginning for tabletop gaming on Nintendo Switch. In addition to these titles, we can also confirm that even more is on the way, including one of the most popular board games ever, Catan, and a dungeon crawler based on Steve Jackson's iconic card game, Munchkin. Stay tuned. Makes sense. All great creations, even nations, begin with a spark. be a good port it will be like a port of the iPad version or something hold an empire in the palm of your hands yeah that's a moment turn friends into the power sure. elite with exclusive four player local multiplayer which i mean some people might like Except whatever six good ushers for them. in a new world on Nintendo Switch November 16th great don't get too cocky, Star Fox. Playtime is over in Starlink. This interplanetary adventure will push you and Fox McCloud to your limits. Let's be honest here. You guys need all the help you can get. Peppy, Falco, and Slippy will provide much needed backup in the new Nintendo Switch exclusive missions found only in Starlink Battle for Atlas. Star Fox, form up on me. Falco here, I got you covered. It's time to lock on. Do a barrel roll and save the Atlas star system, no matter who threatens to stop you. Mm, wolf. Makes sense. <laughs> Never thought I'd miss the food on Corneria. Mix and match parts on your own R-Wing. When Starlink Battle for Atlas takes flight October 16th. That's Nintendo saying we can't make a Star Fox game. Two so. more great RPGs are coming to Nintendo Switch this fall. The world ends with you is way the too expensive. The world ends with you final remix features an all-new story segment called A New Day. 
which contains a remixed map of Shibuya. So you'll really have to scramble to escape the area or face Erasure. New monsters will appear as well, and so will the Reaper, Coco. The World Ends With You final remix launches October 12th. For $60. Before then, guide a group of legendary warriors on a journey through the tragic history that doomed a kingdom and drove a hero down a dark path 500 years before the events of the Xenoblade Chronicles 2 game. Defend yourself from Malos and his forces using all the fury of this refined battle system, allowing you to fight as both the artificial life forms known as Blades and their masters, the Drivers. Newcomers will have the perfect place to start when Xenoblade Chronicles 2 Torna, the Golden Country, launches September 21st. Mm -hmm. Owners of the Xenoblade Chronicles 2 expansion pass can download this new content tomorrow. That's a week early. There's tons in store on Nintendo Switch and even more in store for the future. Join more than 38 million players for yeah, we know about this ninja really. action when Warframe launches November 20th. Get down to Camila Cabello, Bruno Mars, Cardi B, and more anytime, anywhere in Just Dance 2019 on October 23rd. FIFA 19 is fast approaching, and you can pre purchase it on Nintendo Wii Shop tomorrow so you won't miss the ball when it launches September 28th. Speaking of fast, race as a team and win as a team in Team Sonic Racing, launching this winter. The highest rated basketball simulation franchise is back. NBA 2K19 is available now on Nintendo Switch. With hundreds of dollars of money. And get ready to jam in the sequel to the smash hit NBA arcade game, NBA 2K Playgrounds 2, uh -huh. coming this fall. Play as the Joker, Harley, Lex Luthor, and the rest of the best of the worst in the all new LEGO DC Supervillains on October 16th. Final Fantasy comes to Nintendo Switch. Koopo! Wow, this is also 10 frames a second. What, 15 what years doing? after its debut, the co-op action RPG Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles is being remastered for Nintendo Switch. With the new online multiplayer mode, you and your friends can connect and adventure together. No link cable required. On top of that, there are new areas inside dungeons, so even returning fans can explore the unknown. Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles Remastered Edition will launch in 2019. Way before then, players can experience the entire world and story of the latest entry in the core series. That's right. Final Fantasy XV Pocket Edition HD launches later today on Nintendo eShop at an introductory price. A leveled up version of World of Final Fantasy is also on the way. Nice. This title includes a new feature called Avatar Change. I don't know why I said nice. I don't know anything about this game. transform into legendary characters from across the series. They literally look like history. Funko Pops. Is this a Funko Many Pop game? Many fan favorites will show up in the world of Final Fantasy Maxima when it releases on November 6th. Their heads might be too big for Funko Pops. In addition, Pops. more Chocobo's Dungeon is on the way. 2007's Final Fantasy Fables Chocobo's Dungeon returns in superior fashion. Now, Jeez. you can befriend all the monsters. Also, by sharing Joy-Con controllers, you can play cooperatively as well. Chocobo's Mystery Dungeon, Everybody, launches this winter. Okay. Final Fantasy XII is coming to a Nintendo system for the first time. Its real-time battle system is a standout in the Final series, Fantasy offering the ultimate in both Switch freedom getting. and strategy. This I remaster mean, comes loaded with a host the of Switch, extra features, including a speed mode that lets you pick up the pace of your adventure. There's much to discover in the expansive world of Evilus. And now you can put explore 12 on the couch seven. or on the go. Final Fantasy or XII or nine, Zodiac Age launches in 2019. Ten. Which reminds me. Later on, you'll also be able to enjoy these other classics. And their iconic scenes anytime anywhere Final Fantasy 7 9 and 10 10 2 HD remaster are coming to Nintendo Switch in 2019 Where's 8 you cowards Here's a bundle for the ultimate fan What Final Fantasy If you eight, love the you Super cowards. Smash Brothers series check this thing out Oh good it's a black rectangle 
A hardware bundle for Super Smash Bros. Ultimate is on the way. Oh, it's okay. This specially designed dock features fighters from the original Super Smash Bros. game. And of course, the set also includes a download code for Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. There's no better way to show your love for the game. And the set also packs in something you'll want to get your hands on. The Cuddly Controller? These Joy-Con controllers sport a new design as well. <laughs> Two white lines. This Super Smash Bros. Ultimate bundle for Nintendo Switch will launch November 2nd. You can pre-order this special bundle later today. There's November one minute 2nd left. is also the day you can get your own GameCube controller adapter in GameCube Controller Super Smash Bros. Ultimate Edition while supplies last. There's one minute left. That's all the headlines for Nintendo Switch. <sighs> is it still going well? Thank you all for watching. We have a bit more to show you. So, please stick around until the very end. Alright, dude. Impress me. Right now. Yeah. Good. Finally. They're gonna put her in Smash. This isn't, this isn't actually Animal Crossing. This is her in Smash. It just looks like an Animal Crossing trailer. I bet there's, this is actually a Smash trailer. See? She's gonna be in Smash. This is a Smash trailer. from Sakurai. Tom Nook too. I don't know if that's Tom Nook. I don't know Animal Crossing at all. I thought YouTube froze again. It is Tom Nook. This is for Animal Crossing. Right? That makes sense. That was a good way to do it. Except that's not going to be the name. That's it. Is it over? It's gonna. It's gonna hang out on a black screen. Yeah. Okay. It's over. Well, that was. I already forgot everything. I'm not on drugs. Isabella's in Smash. That's all I remember. I guess I'm gonna put this on YouTube now.
stop recording. Goodbye. Let me know if you like this. There's no way you did. If you did, though, maybe I'll do this in the, again. Goodbye.